4,000 instead of 6,000 maybe. I don't know if that's gonna like change something right away, but um, oh my God, Maddie is here. Uh, one of my coworkers that I used to work with at Shoppers Drug Mart, he is popping into the stream. I am doing it, Maddie. We're like both Twitch streamers now. Uh, yeah. Pizza sub combo. What's interesting is the audio isn't lagging, but the video does once in a while. I wonder if like, it, I don't know if everything, maybe the graphics are too high or something. I know I have my WoW graphics turned up like all the way. So let me know if um, my WoW is like lagging or anything. Hopefully not. Um, and hopefully the sound is good on WoW and it's not too loud. I think it's okay. Yeah, you're doing great, Brooke. I'm all like, I'm all like trying really hard, but on the inside, I'm like, oh shit. <laughs> um, but yeah, this is this is why I've been so scared of streaming. But I think that if I just keep doing it, like next stream should be slightly less, and then the next one better, and then before I know it, it'll be like riding a bike. Um, you're good with your bit rate. Minimum is 4,500 for a decent setup. So 4,000 shouldn't hurt. Okay, well, hopefully it's good. Purple, literally just purple. Um, I was, my husband was helping me set up our, like my Discord channel or Discord server. Um, and pretty much all of the roles are just different shades of purple. And it's like, would you expect anything less? I've been like obsessed with purple. Like I had the silver hair for a while and I was like, it just all needs to be purple. So like the fact that even my water bottle is purple, like it's, it's just good. There's so many good things that are happening. And then I have the one green ear because green and purple is cool. Okay, back to, I keep getting distracted. I like look at the chat and then I'm like, what was I doing again? Which is fine, but uh, my brain is like ultra like ADHD right now. And uh, yeah, okay, so. I am right now, I'm working towards getting my class mount for my priest, um, which is like a whole thing. Like, it's always confusing if any of you like play WoW. As far as I know, you have to go through and do all of the campaign stuff to get all of the um, pillars of creation before you can start the quest to do your class mount stuff. Um, and I think you used to have to do the Broken Shore stuff too on every character, but now they made it where if you've done it on one character, you're good, but you still have to go through and do all of the questing. Uh, okay, with the questing, I have done Valshara, Azuna, High Mountain, and I'm almost done Stormheim. I specifically logged out here. I don't think I'll get my mount tonight because I don't know like how much questing I have to do before um, I will get the mount. But um, I logged out here because there was a quest called to catch a banshee. And I was like, this is the perfect place to like start my stream. Um, so yeah, basically I don't usually play Alliance. I mean, I do a little bit, but I hate questing in this area because it's like you're doing stuff for the Alliance and you're like against Sylvanas kind of. So it's like they're trying to like hunt her down. And I was like doing stuff with like Greymane on the ship at the beginning. And he was like fighting the Thanos and I had to like attack Nathanos and I was like this is so wrong I'm having like a crisis um to catch a banshee uh the strange talking Vrykul said I might be able to meet you here I have orders from Greymane uh it seems he may have led he may have a lead on Sylvanas's location he set up a camp near the base of the mountain we've run into some troubles though it looks like the horde may have homed in on our position we could use your help you can take my griffin just speak to me when you're ready to leave um to catch a banshee right i was trying to like before i got on stream i was trying to finish all of the questing in stormheim so that hopefully i could be like on the quest chain to do the mount but i got to that quest and i was like i just i have to stop here this has to be the quest me just running around on wow i feel like more comfortable now on stream but i'm having the thing where i like talk too fast because i uh when I'm nervous, I talk really fast and I'm like, oh shit, calm down and just breathe. <laughs> um, I have such conflicting feelings about the faction I play uh, because I totally feel for the horde races, but the night elf aesthetic, literally same. Like that's pretty much like the night elves is why I play Alliance and I pretty much don't play anything else 
maybe like a Drenai here and there, but the night elves are so me. Like I love them. Like there's they're better than blood elves aesthetically. And the night elf zones, like Teldrassil and Ashenvale, like if I could go anywhere, like if someone was like you can only go to one WoW zone, I feel like most people would be like, Oh, well Brooke would probably pick like Undercity or Tears Fall Glades or like Ghostlands. And I mean, like, part of me wants to, but the other part is like, no, tells you so 100%. The one transmog that they had, I forget what it's called, but it was the one where it was like 20 or $30, and it's so flipping cute. I was trying to not buy it because I can't really afford it right now, but next thing you know, I was just placing the order. I was like, yep, buy now, and I was like, oh, there it is, $20. Um, I'm on, ooh, oh my god, Akalon is here, holy shit. Hello, Akalon. Akalon's like the WoW lore god and like my YouTube um, idol that I look up to. So that is really, really dope. Happy that you are here. Hopefully you're actually here. Yes. Good morning, B. What time is it for you, Akalon? I don't know if you're like, I think you're ahead, but I don't know how much. But I think it's probably like early in the morning. Whoa, hey, Akalon. 5.30 a.m. about to hit the gym. How's the stream going? That is so awesome. I'm so proud of you for going to the gym. Um, the stream is going good, other than I'm nervous, which is uh, normal for me. I haven't really done anything on WoW. I'm just like running around. Um, I think the last thing I was talking about was my transmog, and um, I put the dragon wings with it because I thought it looked kind of cool, and uh, she's cute. But we're going to go back into shadow form because purple freaking gray main i i think gray main is my most hated character in the game like i just want to punch him in the face <laughs> it is good you arrived when you did moonflame um it is true that we may have a lead on sylvanas though i want nothing more than to get my hands on the banshee queen same okay that is something gray man gray main and i have in common because same um the situation here at Greywatch requires immediate attention. Yesterday, a regiment of guards returned with the word, or with word, of forsaken forces in the woods. Several of them bore signs of blight, similar to the one we endured in Gulneas. It would appear these forsaken seek to unleash this blight upon Greywatch. Seek out their catches and destroy them before the blight overtakes us. I love the gym, it's the greatest feeling. Uh, plus there's so much good booty at the gym and Akko appreciates the booty. Oh, we know. I feel like it's always the booty at all times, which I can appreciate too. I'm obsessed with my own booty. Like I do an ungodly amount of squats. Like it's kind of ridiculous. Like I, I got obsessed with doing squats like a year ago and I probably do like anywhere between 50 and 200 a day just because it's fun. Like, I'll just be, like, heating something up in the microwave, and I'm, like, squats. Brushing my teeth, squats. I'm holding my cat, squats. Like, I don't know. It's just, like, it's just all time. I, I don't know when that developed. I feel like my butt was already, like, decent, but I was, like, let's just make it better. So, um, do you miss Lita? I miss Lita so freaking much. I check her Instagram page, like at least once a month or so and I'm like she's just gone um but I mean it's not so bad anymore because it's been so long and I'm just really happy for her so um I miss her and I wish that she would come back but it's like she's doing her thing I'm doing my thing and uh it was an era and I'm glad that there's channels that still have her like videos up to watch and everything that banner looks cool Oh, yes, the Forsaken one. I was like, what, where? I want to have one of these, like, in my house. Like I, like, I need a custom one, or I need to make one. I should, like, figure out how to make it, and then, like, sell it on Etsy or something. And then I'll just, like, make all my money by selling Forsaken banners. I'm so happy with how purple my room is. Like, I keep looking over at, like, my little setup on OBS, and it's like, damn, there's just so much purple. There's just an overall purple glow. No, is there like a spot where it says how long I've been live? I think it's only been like 30 minutes or so. Or something like that. It could be wrong though. Um, burn the banner. And fly away. I just did that without even like dismounting at all. That was bomb. Um, also, how are you guys feeling about Dragonflight? 
and like I feel like my favorite part is the dragon riding so far. I haven't done much of anything. I just leveled my character to max level. I think I was saying that at the start of stream, but um, I haven't been playing like a ton. I did a couple of the looking for group things, just like heroics, just randoms. Speaking of Discord, um, I created a Discord and I think it's like fully set up and ready to go. Um, this should be the link. I'll put it into the chat. Um, my husband helped me like set it all up and everything. I don't know if that link actually works. I hope that it works. I'm going to try to click on it myself. Uh, yeah, it looks like it works. Um, it's like set up where you can go and like verify and everything. And it has, I put like really cool roles. I'm the dark lady. My husband is blight collar. And then, um, there's dark rangers, loyalists, and forsaken, I think. So it's all like Sylvanas themed and stuff. So yeah, um, but I'll try to evolve the discord and everything over time, but I'm really excited to have my own community and have a little place to like talk about YouTube and Twitch and all that stuff. I'm going to drink more water, the like stress drink water, like, oh shit. <laughs> Um, hey Brooke, do you have mods? I don't yet. I guess my husband could be. I haven't like set him up as one, but he could be. Um, but I'll have to, um, look into that. Uh, I know, Akalon, you're pretty hardcore. It's hard to offend Akalon. But, uh, yeah, we'll move away from the topic and let's like talk about WoW. Let's talk about, um, Sylvanas and how... How could they do her like that? Like, what the hell? I'm so mad. The fact that she actually had that one voice line where she was like, not a Banshee Queen, not a Ranger General, but always a Windrunner or whatever. I was like, what do you mean not the Banshee Queen? Like, why would they have her say that? I'm like so upset. I can't even believe it. I want you to have a bomb first stream. I am having a good first stream. I'm still nervous and I kind of have to pee and, um... I do have a BRB screen, so I think I'm going to go pee really quick, and hopefully my BRB screen works. Okay, I have returned. The BRB screen is cute. Thank you. I got it on Etsy, and I just I just loved it. It was totally my vibe. Good morning from Sweden. Oh my god, that is so cool. What time is it there? Suit pot. I love your name. Um... Things are chill, happy to be here and talk nerd things, hell yeah. 5 a.m., oh my gosh, that is so early. Holy hell, I'm like trying to get up earlier in the morning, but more like 7 a.m. or so. I feel like earlier than that is too early for me, but that is crazy. Right now, it's 9 p.m. for me, and I started streaming about an hour ago. Like, is this a good time for most people? Like, I know that... Um, suit pot who just came in it's 5 a.m and it was like 5 or 6 a.m for Akalon but I think are most of you guys like is it the evening for you guys right now because I'm thinking when I stream like I'll try to do a mix of times like maybe some around like now maybe some in the morning just to kind of try to hit everyone how are we all liking Dragonflight so far? My favorite part of the X-Pack is everything involving the Tuscar. I love the Tuscar. I haven't really done much yet in terms of like rep or anything but I did the little soup pot event thing and that was chaotic and I loved it and I need to do it again yeah I think I'll probably do like evening streams like two days a week and then maybe one more like morning slash like afternoon or something greetings from Edmonton I have been to Edmonton once before I went to the mall the Edmonton mall with the they have like a water park and stuff in there that was really really cool in New Brunswick, that is awesome. Never been there. Um, I am embodying chaos. I went to get laundry and came back with beer. Let's go! Hell yeah, Maddie. I still don't like, I'm not into beer. I'm barely into drinking at all. The only drink that I guess I like, I don't even know what it's called. I think it's called like Breezer. It's like the one that tastes like orange creamsicle, but I haven't had it in like five years. But uh, that was pretty good. That's pretty much all that I've tried. There could be other stuff that I like, but I've just never tried it before. Listen, drugs are great, but have you ever tried water? 
literally maddie do you remember me talking about i think that it was when you worked there i used to like brag about not drinking water like there was like a solid like five year period at shoppers where i would just be like i I don't drink water at all i drink like one glass of water a week i just survive off of energy drinks and people would be like brooke that's not good and i'm just like i don't know i just don't like water and look at me now look at the glow up the ultimate water glow up and I pretty much only drink water now. I barely, I do remember. Oh my God. I think that I thought that it was like cool because I was trying to channel the like nerdy, weird World of Warcraft girl. And I was like, oh, these people will think it's so cool that I don't drink water because I'm just like such a hardcore gamer. And that was like a whole era. I'll probably get off and like, I'll try to get to the kind of end of this quest chain where we see the... Sylvanas and Greymane cinematic thing with the lantern. I'll probably end it there, but it's been pretty good. I mean, like, I'm still pretty nervous, but I have to say getting up to go pee and coming back and kind of, like, recouping myself, I feel a little bit better now. Which is good news because that kind of tells me that when I go to stream again for my second time, it should be a little bit easier. Um... Dude, the time I'm in a long-standing loving relationship and almost every chick at my work is trying to flirt with me, please no, right? It's like, same. Like, I'm like hella married and hella in love and it's like, I don't know, it's just weird. Like, not that I get like a ton of DMs, but it's like, why does any guy even try? Because it's literally never gonna happen. So, uh, it's also funny the amount of times, like, I'll get a DM and it's like, do you have a boyfriend? And it's like, my dude, it literally says that I'm married in my bio. Like, if you couldn't even take the time to read my bio, I'm not even gonna talk to you. Like, you know? I can't believe how long Derek and I, like it's already been, it was summer of 2019. So it's already been like three and a half years. And it's like, what the hell? We went through the full long distance and that felt like the longest time ever while it was happening. But now that it's over, it's like, it's like, what? We went through that? Like, that was, like, a long time, but now it just feels like nothing. I don't know. It's, like, weird how time, during it, it's, like, dragging on, but, like, it does go by, kind of, obviously. But, uh, yeah. And then it's crazy. This year, I can't believe how fast it went by. Um, Valkyr, you say? This is worse than I had imagined. If Sylvanas is able to create more Valkyr, there will be no limit to her armies. It seems the vault is her goal. We must stop her. I'm all like, bitch, what do you mean stop her? I don't want to stop her. It's like when the quests are contradicting with like your personal goals. It's like, but can I just like abandon this quest and go run to my queen? I'm still so mad. I wish that like what would have happened instead if Sylvanas was able to use her little lantern thing on Ayer and actually be able to do her stuff with the Valkyr. Like I bet all of Shadowlands would have been avoided. Uh, yes, you can do it. Try not to put too much pressure on yourself. Just have fun on WoW with us. Yes. I definitely, that's another thing. I need to remember it's not as intense as my mind is making it. Like, nobody cares as much as I care, if that makes sense. Like, in my mind, I'm like, oh shit, we're streaming, and it's a big deal. And everyone else is like, hey, we're just here to watch your stream. So it's like, I, I think that that's kind of comforting to know it's not super big. Um... I'll say one thing though, be careful with the burnout. If you're going to have anxiety, that's perfectly normal, but overstreaming, although we love that you're here, it's very real. I'm down to two days a week because I can't do it more without feeling like I'm going nuts. That is very true too. I was thinking I would start with like three days a week, like two hour sessions, but um, if I need to go down, I will. And um, if I need to take a break, I will, but I'm definitely gonna try to stick with it at least for a little bit, but um, yeah. I'm sure I will get to the point of feeling burnout. I know I did when I streamed with Derek like a year or two ago. I got like super burned out. So, I mean, there's a very high chance that's going to happen again. So, it's good to know. And it's good to know most people are pretty like accepting of that nowadays with like mental health and stuff. I feel like everyone's like, you know, like, yeah, take a break, relax, make sure you're okay mentally. So, that's nice. Uh, I think that we're going in. I think we're going in for the cinematic. So let's get ready to watch it, even though I've seen it like a million times. There's There might be some of you in chat who haven't seen the cinematic. So 
if there's anyone here who hasn't, even though I'm assuming most of you play WoW and stuff, um, we're about to see my queen in action, so this should be good. Um, it is good to see you, Moonflame. The assault on Dreadwake's landing feared poorly, and I had thought our cause lost until Crowley informed me of your success. Now let's finish this. The Banshee Queen is here. I'd recognize those tainted arrows anywhere. This is the moment we have been fighting for. Sylvanas will answer for her crimes against Varian Wren and for the Alliance to arms. Oh shit, here we go. Yes, Queen. Ooh, you haven't seen it. This is a good cinematic. Just because she's a badass. Thank you for the follow. Freaking badass upside down. This made me so mad the first time I watched it. Literally hate Greymane so much. Sylvanas can respectfully crush me, right? That's how I feel about her, too. 100%. Um, you're awake. We nearly lost you there. It's a good thing we managed to get you and Greymane out of there in time. Otherwise, we wouldn't have been able to reverse Sylvanas' poison. Could you imagine if Greymane just died right there? God, that would have been good. Um, it's a shame she got away, but her plans in school the shield failed, and we have to thank you for it. I'm sure Greymane will order a, a commendation uh, for you once he is fully recovered. You did a great thing here. Bane of the Dark Lady. Let's take it. Woo! Okay. Um, what the fuck? <laughs> yeah, basically, um, I feel like if Sylvanas was able to actually capture Ayer, which is what she was doing with like the lantern thing there, she would have been able to create endless Valkyr, and everything in Shadowlands probably could have been avoided, because the Valkyr um, can basically raise undead forever, um, and keep her alive forever, and it's like, oh god, if Greymane had, could have just fucked off, um, we could have avoided probably everything in the Shadowlands, and uh, she would still be the Banshee Queen, so that was kind of an iconic and sad moment in terms of... Uh, Greymane ruined everything for her and I hate him <laughs> and I want him to die. I literally hate him so much. Okay, we are almost done. I think I may as well um, kind of finish the quest chain. I think that this last little segment of quests is like everything and then I think I'm supposed to like run the dungeon to get the the Aegis of Agrima or whatever. Wow, I hate him, right? Same. Show you guys the mount. I don't know what it's called. Let me search it on Google. This is the mount that I'm trying to get. It's like the coolest mount ever. It's a purple owl. Like, it's so cool. Um, so basically, I don't know if I'll like stream it again because like I'm almost done tonight. But I think after I finish all of these quests in Stormheim, then I can start the quest to get that mount. And I'm really, really excited about it. It's so cool. Yeah, I feel like I, it's all about, like, I feel like everyone has their like purpose and like their thing that they can do and mine I think is like helping 
noobs and bringing the wholesomeness back to WoW. And the main reason I play WoW is to relive nostalgia, to be honest. Like, that's, that's the main reason why I'm so addicted to it, is because all day long I'm like, I gotta relive my, like, nostalgia from when I was, like, 13 years old, so I'm gonna go, like, quest in Westfall for the 57th time this week, you know? That's kind of my vibe. So, uh, I hope that I can, like, channel that somehow, because I know that there's people out there who feel the same way. Okay. The Aegis of Agrimar. Now that it's out of the hands of the Legion, the Aegis should be brought back to Dalaran for safekeeping while the hunt continues for the rest of the Pillars of Creation. It should be safe in the central portal chamber until the time comes when it is needed. Okay, we did it. I did all of the zones. We finished them all. So I don't know if like, I hope I get a quest because like I said, every time I go to do these like class or order hall, mount things. I feel like it's very unclear what you're supposed to do next. I'm always like googling stuff like, where do I go to start the order hall quests? What achievements do I need to do? I'm gonna go to my class order hall and see if there is a quest. Dalaran is pretty right. I love Dalaran. Um, don't feel weird about it. You probably think about it more than other people do. Just be yourself, right? So true. 100% I definitely do overthink the hell out of things, like way too much. My priest campaign. I haven't finished that yet. I need to work on that still. See, there's like so many things. I can't believe they make you do, like you have to do all of this over on every character that you want the class mount on. I feel like that's a lot of stuff. Ah, <sighs> okay. Anyways, though, I think that I'm going to end the stream here for now we hit the two hour mark pretty much it's one hour and 58 minutes um what is your favorite expansion so far uh i want to say burning crusade um just because i have the most like nostalgia from that era but maybe not actually because i was so young during that time but that's why it was so good because it was so nostalgic but in terms of actually my favorite probably no maybe okay it's so hard it's like they were all different for they were all good for different reasons legion was pretty good i know that i didn't like missa pandaria or warlords of draenor and then when legion came out i was really really excited it was like oh my god illidan's coming back so i feel like probably legion just because i feel like it was like a long time of not good it's like classic was good Burning Crusade was good. Wrath of the Lich King was really, really good. Cataclysm was shit because it, like, destroyed the world and all of my zones that I loved so much. So I was really, really mad. Um, didn't like Mists of Pandaria. Didn't like Warlords of Draenor. Legion was the next good one. Battle for Azeroth was weird but good in terms of Sylvanas. And Shadowlands was not good. Um, so I guess my answer would be Burning Crusade and Legion because they both have... Illidan and my nostalgia is tied to it and Illidan is the bomb uh, Definitely join the discord because that'll be a good way to like keep kind of Track of like what we're up to on stream and everything and get closer to everyone um, I have it where you can like go into the roles channel and click the little bow and arrow thing and you can become a Loyalist in my server. So if you want to become a loyalist in my server for the dark lady make sure to do that and uh, yeah, it should be fun. There's like spots in my Discord to talk about WoW, talk about WoW lore, um, ask questions if you're a WoW noob. There's like a general chat. There's a place to kind of have like girly chats if you want to talk about like hair and makeup or like periods or anything. Um, there's a mental health channel. So yeah, I'm going to try to be active on the Discord. Um, all right. Uh, thank you guys so much for hanging out. I really, really appreciate it. And I will update you guys on Instagram and in the Discord uh, when I'm going live and all that good stuff. So I hope you all have a super good night and happy new year because I don't know if I'll stream again before the new year, but maybe we will see. But I love you all so much and have a lovely night.